This is Alin from Javelin and in this video I will share with you a time-saving tech tip for quickly expanding or collapsing the flyout feature manager design tree. And that is because the space where I have the primary feature manager design tree is also being shared with the property manager, the configuration manager, the display manager, and if I would have some other add-ons activated I would probably see other tabs. It's quite common that when you try to select, let's say, a component or a feature, this space is being covered by some other uh, tabs. Case in hand, I would like to mate this, um, this uh, spider uh, with uh, this yoke in such a way that they would be centered to each other. And since I know that the width mate will consume too many resources when I do rebuilds, I'm just going to try to add a simple coincident mate between the symmetry plane of uh, the spider and the symmetry plane of uh, the yoke. So let me start the mate command and uh, as you can see automatically SolidWorks give me gives me access to the tree. Sometimes though you find this tree it's, uh, it has collapsed and uh, if you have a good hand-eye coordinate uh, coordination you might be able to expand it and collapse it by selecting this plus or minus icon. What I learned a couple of weeks ago from uh, Jeremiah Davis from uh, SOLIDWORKS is that you can get the same um, behavior by just selecting this bar on top of the uh, property manager of the entity that you're editing. So notice when I click on this and I click again I'm expanding or collapsing this uh, flyout feature tree. There is even a shortcut key assigned to this operation and that is the C key. So now I'm just going to press C on my keyboard and as you can see I'm collapsing or expanding this uh, flyout feature tree. So now I can just try to find my uh, my planes, so that would be one and this will be the other one and as you can see this mate has been successfully added. 